Hey YouTube, it's Cape Cod Cuda. Uh, you know I just got those wheels over there for my uh, Ford Explorer. It was a 2007 Ford Explorer uh, Ironman edition rims. Well, these were my wheels that w that I had on it, the little 16-inch Ford Explorer wheels. I had them painted uh, flat black. Uh, and the paint lasted on there a really long time and stuff. I cleaned the wheels up and uh, I just sprayed them with what I had here. I bought this, I bought a can of this recently, uh, Rust Oleum Gloss Black. It's the powder coat. And I hadn't used it, so it was a full can. So I figured I'd just paint the wheels with that. Uh, it has that different new, the new type nozzle on it. The can, you can see the can's new too. I had to squeeze the, the top off. And it's got this kind of nozzle on it. I didn't like how it sprayed too much. But gloss black, the gloss of it shows a lot more imperfections in the wheels and stuff like that where the clear coat was peeling. When I was cleaning the wheels, I took a steel wheel brillo to them. And uh, I try to smooth out some of the clear coat peels, and uh, I didn't get them all. I, was, I didn't want to give that much detail to them because I was selling them, and I just wanted to get rid of them and stuff. Uh, but with the gloss black, they do look crappier. <laughs> uh, let them bake here in the sun, see if they clear up a little. Uh, here's a set of Cobra wheels I had bought off Craigslist for uh, $125. Uh, I was going to put these on my Ford Explorer. Two of the wheels have bends in them. That's the worst of it. Here's the other one. And I decided not to use those, so I have them back on Craigslist for the $125 I bought them for. And I have a, a local guy that says he wants them for his 5 lug conversion. He already has black wheels on there, so maybe he has two bent wheels and he's trying to get two good wheels. Then I have these 22s for sale. Um, I don't know. They get. They were originally for F-150, and they only had the five lug pattern. Somebody brought them to one of those fill and drill places, and uh, they put a six bolt pattern on them. I believe it's for a Chevy uh, six bolt pattern, and. Um, I originally got them for the Dodge Dakota I was working on, that Dodge Dakota project I had. I was going to throw them on the Dodge Dakota and try to make some kind of little truck out of it, paint it a, you know, like a yellow or a Ford light blue color, one of those green or whatever like that. Just painted a flashy color with these wheels on it and hoping that I could sell it to some, to somebody and stuff. But the six lug bolt pattern was not the correct size for my uh, Ford Explorer, I mean for my Dodge Dakota. So these are on Craigslist too. These 22s, I got them on there for 100 bucks. Uh, the tires are all dry rotted. They have deep tread on them, but they're all dry rotted and stuff. And um, they have some pitting on them and stuff. I mean, you can clean them up and paint them and stuff, but I just don't want to deal with them. So I figured a quick hundred dollars. I didn't pay nothing for all the wheels. I got actually got them for free. So a quick hundred dollars, just get them out of my way. They're too big to store. Uh, again, $125 on the Cobra, the Cobra wheels, because that's what I paid for them. I just want my money back. These have all new tires on them. Uh, you've seen in my other videos and stuff. This one I just bought like two or three months ago. I think I paid $130 for it or something like that, for that one tire. Something like that. I, I don't know. They're only 205s. 205, 60, 16. That's a VF Goodrich tire. All the other ones are Kelly Charger wheels because I had a whole set and I popped, popped the tire. Uh, these Explorer Ford Ranger wheels fetch like $200 just, just for the set by themselves, just the rims without tires. And uh, people are selling tires for $25 plus a piece.
so you would be talking about three hundred dollars worth of rims and tires uh, I put them on 250 I was putting them on there for 200 but I have a spare also with a brand new tire so all five wheels for 250 that's fifty dollars a wheel that's what I put them on there I've gotten one call so far and uh, I cleaned up the wheels just before that one call um, but I got them on the trailer painting them up and uh, that's Cape Carcuda signing out. Just trying to get rid of all these extra wheels I have so I can get back in the garage and start doing some projects. Cape Carcuda signing out and about to sneeze. Thanks for watching.